Welcome to Celebrity of Ives. Camila Cabela looks trendy in a flowy sundress while out with boyfriend Sean Mendes. We will break it all down for you. But before we continue, please, if you are new to this channel, please take a minute of your precious time to subscribe and hit the notification bell for more updates. Let's dive into the video. Summer Days Camila Cabela was spotted rocking a cute, flowy sundress while out and about with boyfriend Sean Mendes on Sunday, July 18. Unfortunately, the A-list couple who began dating in September 2019 ran into some car trouble during their daytime date. The Havana singer, 24, and the Stitches artist, 22, were photographed locked out of their black Mercedes Benz. Thankfully, it didn't take long before Sean and Camila found the keys and drove off into the sunset. Sean Mendes and Camila Cabello follow us on Instagram and join our Telegram channel for the latest updates. Sean Mendes and his girlfriend Camila Cabello had their home in Los Angeles broken into whilst the couple were in the house. The thieves made a quick exit, but not before stealing the keys to the There's Nothing Holding Me Back hitmaker's G Wagon and taking the vehicle, getting away in his Mercedes SUV, TMZ reports. Police reports were made, but there have been no arrests so far, according to sources. Sean and Camila walking their dog near their Los Angeles home recently. Sean and Camila have been dating for two years, and the former previously admitted it took five years before he realized he was in love with her. Watching back a clip from a joint interview the couple did in 2015, years before they became an item, Sean said. It's really hard to watch it back. I remember that. I didn't even accept that I was completely in love with her. Three years after that is when I finally admitted it, and another two years after that was when I decided to do something about it. The 22-year-old singer recently said dating the Havana hitmaker has taught him to be less afraid of speaking from his heart and more vulnerable. Speaking about his feelings, he added, I realized I had a lot of fear as a human to say how my heart was feeling. I realize when it comes to matters of the heart, we don't really have to be experts. I thought that I was a pretty open guy until I started being in a relationship with someone that I really, truly love and, realizing that oh no, I really have this big ego, and I don't want to show her that I'm hurting, and I don't want to show her that that offended me, and like I want to be the man, and I want to be strong in this relationship. It was hurting our relationship, but real strength does lie inside of being emotional and vulnerable. Bang Showbiz on the Man Enough podcast, Sean Mendes revealed that he is afraid of being the bad guy in his relationship with singer Camila Cabello after an argument. Recently on the Man Enough podcast, Sean Mendes revealed that he is afraid of being the bad guy in his relationship with singer Camila Cabello after the pair recently had an argument. During his conversation, Sean admitted that he and Camila had a disagreement when he raised his voice at her. The Treat You Better singer revealed that he got so defensive. On the Man Enough podcast, Sean Mendes revealed that he is afraid of being the bad guy in his relationship with singer Camila Cabello after an argument. Recently on the Man Enough podcast, Sean Mendes revealed that he is afraid of being the bad guy in his relationship with singer Camila Cabello after the pair recently had an argument. During his conversation, Sean admitted that he and Camila had a disagreement when he raised his voice at her. The Treat You Better singer revealed that he got so defensive. The singer recalled, I raised my voice at her, and she was like, I don't like it when you raise your voice. Why did you raise your voice and I got so defensive? He added, I was like, I wasn't raising my voice at you. And I did raise my voice at her. And I felt her shrink and I felt me grow and I was like, oh god, this is the worst. I'm so terrified of being evil. I'm so scared to be bad. I don't want to be bad. Sean went on that they had to get in this massive conversation about the fear, as he did not want to be perceived negatively. Please tell us in the comments. Please don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell to see our latest updates.